This is the Lock Picking Lawyer, and the lock I have for you today is the worst of the worst. It is a 40 millimeter Chinese laminated padlock with a plastic core. If you look really closely at the right at the bottom of the keyway, you can see the gray plastic of the lock body. Now, obviously, that gives rise to a whole lot of security flaws. In video number 60, I took advantage of one of them by just sticking a screwdriver in the keyhole, twisting it with a wrench, and we broke it open. I want to try something different today. I'm going to see if I can open it just by heating the core with a normal lighter. I got this guy for about five bucks at the cigar store. And we'll use this and a tension wrench and see if we can open it up. So let me get this arranged in the vise and then we'll get to work. Okay, I'm all set up in the vise and we are ready to get going. I have my lighter ready to go and I have a wide tension wrench and every five or 10 seconds, I'm just gonna put her in and just give it a twist to see if we have compromised the lock enough to get it to open. So let's get to work. Let me turn the, uh, the butane up a bit. There we go. Let's see. Nope, not quite. Uh-oh. There we go. Let's get back to work. Had that guy up just a little bit too high. I'm starting to smell a little bit of plastic in there. Not quite ready. Uh-oh. Getting a little bit of smoke off of it. We must be close. There we go. We got her. There we go. Got her open. Okay, so just a few seconds with my with my little Firebird lighter and we open this lock. Ladies and gentlemen, this is why you avoid cheap locks. These locks you get for one or two dollars from China, there's a reason they're one or two dollars. So that's it for now with our plastic core Chinese laminated padlock. If you have any questions or comments, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.